So we've got some blueberries. We've got some seedless grapes. So I've got two packs of this seedless grapes. I've got some apples. I've got two packs of these apples. There's one here somewhere out. I think the kids have already put those. <laughs> um, yeah, blueberries, two packs of strawberries. There's the other one. And then, not strawberries, grapes, sorry. And then I've got a big, large strawberries there as well. And I've got more. I've got two packs of tangerines because the children love tangerines. And then I've got some pears as well. And look what we had in this week. So we had the bigger bag this week. So I was really, really happy about that. Um, so, so happy. And then I got some cucumbers, small cucumbers for Natalia to snack on. Let's put that there. I got two packs of bananas. Oh, there's another apple. I thought we could stop them, but we didn't. <laughs> I got two packs of those. Spinach. We love our spinach in our house. We really, really do. It's the best. Um, another pack of bananas. And then I got some shredded wheat. Um, I have this for my breakfast, guys. Um, because I am on a not not a diet, just watching what I'm eating basically, guys. Um, I'm watching what I eat, I eat, and these are good for your heart as well. So that's even better. I do love shredded wheat. So if I get hungry, like around about eight nine o'clock, I'll have a bowl of these as well. So yeah, instead of like going in the cupboard and eating a packet of crisps or eating a chocolate, I do. I am on um low cal calories chocolate. So. Chocolate with like 70 calories. I've run out of everything in those. So I'll have to pick some of them up, them up over the weekend. I do love um, the chocolates, the ones with the less calories. So I can have a chocolate bar without worrying. It's too much calories. So I need to pick some up over the weekend. So yeah, shredded wheat. I love my shreddies. And then I got some biscuits for the children. So I got some chocolate chip. I've got three bags of those. And then I've got Oreos, Natalia's favourite. And I've got four packs of those. And then I've got some Jammy Dodgers. I've got a few packs of those, but I think kids have already took one packet. <laughs> you know, it's like you come in from school and, you know, you feel a bit peckish. So the kids have already took some of those. And then I've got my sauces. So I've got Tika. So I've got two Tikas. Um, and I've got another one of them under the cupboard. And then I got some ketchup, a red sauce, <laughs> and then I've got some pasta sauce. Not bad, this only 45p in Alda. Um, it's not bad to be honest with you guys. 45p for a tin of sauce. Um, I got a jar of sauce, sorry, that's not bad. And then I got another one as well, so that'll be for pasta sauce for one of my meals, plans, curry sauce. For my curry, so I'm going to be having a tea cut and a um, chicken, a curry sauce. Like this is really nice. This it is really really nice. It just tastes like Chinese curry from the chippy that one. It is nice, and it's only that's only 45p as well. So not bad. I have got a few sauces still under the cupboard, so I didn't need to get too many to be honest with you. And then I've got these pouches. Because there's so much is them eggs are not eggs. Um, yogurts I got last week from Aldi, the twelve pack. Um, for like younger children, like babies. Seriously, guys, it's very hard to get them like off. You know when you like take them off, it's really hard. They don't come off, and they just make pure mess and get everywhere. So I thought I'm not buying them this week because it makes life harder, especially when Natalia wants one. So these pouches are so much easier. You just take them out of the box and there you go. She's got a yogurt. So I've got her a few boxes of those. And then crisp wise, I got some Monster Munch, only £1.25. Let's just lift it back a bit. Can't really see. Monster Munch, how many packs do you get in these? Um so you get three flaming hot, you get four pickled onion, and you get three roasted beef. 
as a 10 pack, 125. That is really, really good. Especially our dear crispies at the minute everywhere else. Seriously, guys, really expensive crisps these days. And I got Miss Nelly these. So that's another 10 pack for 125 as well. And then I got the big family pack. These are £3.49, I think these are, and you get 30 of those as well, so yeah, I got those, and then I got these, um, the kids absolutely love these, so if they're coming from school or whatever and they need a snack, then they've got those to snack on, so yeah, and then I got my cheese as well, so I've got some cheese there. And then I got these yogurts for the older children, so chocolate mousses. I got a few packs of those there. And then I've got pork pies for hubs. And I got some more sausages here. I got two packs of these. Um so yeah. And then I got Nally these. She's loved these since being around six months when she was able to have food. She has loved these for so, so, so long. And then I got these for the children as well. They love these. They absolutely love these. They love these so, so much. And then I got cocktail sausages there as well. So <clears throat> just another snack in the fridge if the kids need like a snack or whatever or for lunch or, you know, bought cocktail sausages there. And then I got three of the sausage rolls three packs of the sausage rolls as well and then you don't see an alley in the background guys and then we got the big pack of mushrooms so they will do about two or three meals so yeah i got some orange juice and noodles because nally is loving noodles at the minute um if you watch my family vlogs then she's being really picky at the minute and she's only eating certain food. So I have to get in what she will eat. So I've got a few packs of those. And then I've got some greens here. A few packs of the greens. So they just taste like, um, you know, the Milky Bar ones. Not Milky Bar. Yeah, I think there's Milky Bar. I think. I don't know. But yeah, they just taste like them. They're, they're nice. And then I got some pancakes as well. So I get two of those. And then some paste. I get a few of those for pat lunches. And then I get some strawberry jam. I've got some strawberry jam there. And then ham. So I get cooked chicken ham. Uh, British cooked chicken. Um, Isabella and Ethan love that one. And then British honey roast ham. I love this one. I love this one so much. I like to have this with um, oh, mashed potatoes, boiled ham with mashed. This isn't, I know this isn't boiled ham, guys. This is honey roast, but it's just as good. Um, I like to have this with potatoes with mixed. Um, or I forgot them spring onions in the mashed potatoes with this. <gasps> so good. Comment down below if you've ever had it. So good, Sarah Saga. More chicken. Um, where's my other ham? I can't remember. Oh, I've got another one here. I've got British cooked ham, and then I've got a classic salad, and then cheese and chive. <laughs> I called this the wrong thing last week. I'm surprised none of you guys said. <laughs> I thought when I watched my video back, I thought one of the guys will will notice but no one did i called it cheese and hives <laughs> i meant cheese and chive last week so yeah nobody noticed so that's good and then i got a chunky salsa dip and then i got these on special offer today so 30 percent off because i think a few is missing um so i'm gonna give the kids one of these in a minute and um, they've been waiting patiently and then I've got some baby wipes. I've got some more baby wipes. Oh, I don't think I showed you the preps, did I, guys? Did I show you the preps? I can't remember. Um, some mayonnaise. Um, we got some milkshake as well. Got some milkshake. 
chocolate. And then we got a banana one as well. And then we got some tin be baked beans. And then we got some cereal. The kids are obsessed with this cereal. They are obsessed. Um, they love it so much. And they got one, two, three. And then I've got some pasta as well to go with my pasta, one of my meals this week. So I have got two of these. Um, I put one in the cupboard. Um, so that will be for spaghetti bolognese and then um, pasta just with this actually. Where is it? So I'm going to mix that with it and throw a few peppers and stuff. Mix some peppers and onions and stuff with it. So that would be a nice meal as well. And then i got some more sausages there as well. So yeah. Mayonnaise. Can't forget the mayo. So I'll go for the lighter mayonnaise. And then I've got... Keep have to keep bending over, guys. Just go all the way around. A big bottle of milk. Semi-skinned we go for, guys. So, yeah, we go for that one. The big fat one. Then I needed washing powder this week. So I go with non-bio because Isabella has eczema and so does Riley. Um, so, and this is real. it smells like purcell. It smells really, really nice. And it smells like fairy non-bio as well. Um, it does smell really, really nice. So what I'll do is I'll walk around now, guys, because I'm running out of room here. Got Miss Nelly some nappies. Um, so I've got a size five. And then I went for the, last week I went for the nine rolls, but this week I've gone for the 24, the 24 rolls. So yeah, somebody told me about this last week, but because I'm so used to going for the um, nine rolls, I think it were, I think it was nine rolls. Somebody told me for four pounds, because I paid two, one ninety nine for the um nine rolls but someone told me for 24 rolls it's only four pounds something so i'm happy with that i'm really really happy with that because i didn't know that because obviously when i go there i just get the one i'm used to getting but 24 rolls for four pound 49 i think it is 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 it's so much better so yeah i picked those up today um and then i got some damn jammy dodgers um, and I think that is it from Aldi so far, guys. I'm going to go on to um, Iceland now. So, yeah, that is everything. So, I'm just going to move everything off here. Oh, I'm going to give you the total of Aldi first, guys. All this, how much it came up to today. So, I'll show you the receipt so, of that. Here's the receipt, guys. Here's today's receipt. And comment down below, guys, what you think it's going to be today. Drum roll, please. It comes in at £120.6p. Now, that is an absolute bargain. So, only £10 over last week's. So, that is a bargain, guys. That is a bargain. So, I filled my fridge. I filled my cupboards. Plus, I the only reason it's not... It's a bit over... This week is because I needed nappies, washing powder, and toilet roll. So, yeah. So, I've got cereal, um, ham, and everything like that. Crisps, snacks, everything that I need for the kids. Cereals, um, red sauce, a load of fruit and veg, potatoes, the lot. For £120, guys, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. So, yeah, I'm really happy with that. I'm really, really happy with that. And you know what? You get so much. It's all messed up at the minute, guys, because I've been going through it all. But £120, guys, it really, really, really is good from Alda. <clears throat> I absolutely love Alda. Um, for £120 for all this, you cannot go wrong. You really can't. So, Alda gets a big thumbs up from me, especially when you have a large family. It's a bargain. I'm happy. Happy days. So now I'm going to get into me frozen food from Iceland. So I'm going to put all this away and then I'll show you what I picked up from Iceland and I'll show you how much that comes to and I'll share my meal preps with you in that one as well. So let's get on the next So one. first off, we're going to start with what meals I have planned for this week. 
So, do you know what, guys? I'm really happy that I slimmed and started doing three for ten, especially like when you have a big family. So I went for two pack of the fives, two packs of the fives, and then I went for these ones, fifteen percent extra free so you get a lot more especially when you've got a huge family like mine <laughs> you know um because i like doing big hot meals because it's it goes for everybody do you know what i mean guys it goes for everyone so i like the big meals um so yeah like a chicken casserole or a chicken curry or chicken and rice you know this is the kind of food I like to cook. Um, so, three for £10. So, that's going to be for a curry. That's going to be for chicken and rice. And this one's going to be for a chicken casserole. So, that's three meals planned already. Um, the next meal I have planned is a family steak pie. This is not big enough for us, guys. So I got today two for £6 in Iceland. So that will definitely do us. So I don't know if I'm going to do mashed potatoes or boiled um, potatoes for this or chips. I think I might go for boiled potatoes with this, with peas or beans and gravy. I don't know. But that is another meal. So one, two, three, four meals are ready. And then we've got some minted lamb chops here. So that's going to be for another meal. Meal. So that's. Oh, let me show you. Got minted lamb. Um. So, um, I probably do this with chips beans as well chips and beans um that will be so good or i could do it with boiled potatoes again i'm not sure and that is another meal so we've got one two three four five meals already and that was on the three for ten so i mixed and matched a little bit there and then i got some pizzas here so i got garlic bread as well because the kids are obsessed with this so we would have that with spaghetti bolognese and then I got the 12 sliced hot dog rolls. I like having these because they don't go off and you can freeze them. So if you're not having hot dogs, for instance, tomorrow or the next day, or you decide you don't want hot dogs till the last meal, number six, at the end of the week, do you know what I mean? But then the next week, because I have got a few meals on here. Um, so if I decided I wanted hot dogs at the end of next week, you're not worried that they're going to go off. So that's the plus with frozen hot dogs. I do get the frozen burger buns as well. So, yeah. And then I got three, four, ten on lunch items for the weekend. So if the kids wanted to have some dippers with ketchup, then you get 50 dippers and then you get 42 nuggets and another 50 dippers. The kids like the dippers more than they like the nuggets. So, so I got three for ten pounds, but I got two of the dippers because that's the kids' favourite. So three for ten again, and then I got these pizzas. I absolutely love the vegetarian one. It's really nice. The vegetable. Oh my god, it's so nice. It's got spinach on it as well. It's got spinach on it, guys. Um, and then I got some pepperoni. So the kids love pepperoni. Um, that is their favourite pizza. Um, we don't eat out, and well, we we go to Morrison's, but we don't eat takeaway or anything anymore. Um, so I'm not at McDonald's for seven weeks. <laughs> I'm doing well. But obviously we'll take the kids for a treat at McDonald's still, guys. I think that's what Cody wants for his birthday dinner. And then I have a spaghetti bolognese and I have a chiller. And yeah, so how many meals is that all together? I lost count now. So one, two, three, um, four. Five, six, seven. And where's my sausages gone? My sausages are somewhere unless the kids have put them in the freezer. That's another meal. So I have about eight meals. Eight meals. Got some eggs. Got 15 um, eggs as well. And then I got the big packs. Big pack value. So I've got the big value pack 
of french fries. I've got two of those, so I need some of them um, over the weekend. Hubs will just run to Iceland and get me some of them because they're quite big, to be honest. And then I've got my mincemeat. So, yeah, I've got about eight meals here, guys. And I'll show you the total of that in a minute. And then I've got my coffees. So, you get 18 coffees in here for £2. That is an absolute bargain i always get these from there i usually get two but i only got one um i don't know why i just picked up the one I shouldn't have done that because it got to last me for a week and then i got these for the children so these are a pound these are a pound and you, these taste like magnums there's no different to the branded one from this one guys and only a pound as well and then i got the chocolate one and then i got another one that's what the kids are waiting for right now they're waiting for these <laughs> because I've promised them those so yeah only a pound and then these are new in these are new in these so I've got these for children so you get lemon and raspberry a pound and look at the size look at the size they're really really big so I've got that one lemon and raspberry then I got watermelon a pound and then I got lemon and strawberry. Hey, yes, yeah, strawberry baby girl. And then I got lemon and lime. So these are new in Alda. Not Alda, sorry. Oh my days. Not Alda. Iceland Warehouse. And they're quite big as well. And they've got these in um, Iceland Warehouse. So it's like a new cleaning. Um, cleaning. It's called Home in Iceland. And it's all, it's all a pound. So I've got these for a pound. For my toilet, I got these for a pound, so I clean them for my floor. One minute sun, and then I got some new mica cloths for a pound, and then I got this spray for a pound as well. And look at the size of this, guys! How can I show you? Um, I got that for a pound. <clears throat> I got these, um, so you get three of these for three pound in Iceland Warehouse, and the children really do love these. So you get three for a pound. Uh, not three for a pound. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to concentrate on the kids in the background, guys. So you get three for three pounds. So basically, a pound each. And the same with the Warburton's bread. Three for three pound again. So basically, a pound. They're your biscuits, sweet girl. They're from Alda. Um, so one, two, three. So... So basically, one pound each, guys, so you get three for a pound. Same with these as well, I got for the kids. Three for a pound. Again, so I've got the kids. Um, trying to think. Trying to, yeah, three for a pound, yeah. And then I got the chocolate ones. So I've got three of those for a pound. They've already been open because the kids have already put one of those. Plus six. Four. And then a big sugar free no no i did sugar and um, didn't so so yeah that is it from iceland warehouse today and yeah i'm happy with that so i'm gonna give you the total so i'm add it all up now and see how much today's shopping alda and iceland have come up to so yeah and like i said guys i've got eight and nine meals here eight and nine meals so yeah let's do the subtotal and let's check how much this one comes to and then um, add it all up. Today's Iceland warehouse comes to 88. 88.35. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add it all up now and then I'll get back to you guys. So, today's haul comes up to, let me just get it for you guys, it comes up to £208.41p. So, that's for Iceland and, um, Alda. So I think that is an absolute bargain, especially for the size of our family. And I have about nine or ten meals as well. So I'm really, really happy with that. Really happy with that. So I won't have to go out during the week for any meals that I need. I'm gonna have a whole week of even um over a week of meals. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with that. I probably need to go out for like fridge stuff and things like that, and you know, juice or stuff like that, you know, because you can never have too much juice and stuff like that and bread and you always need that because that is just constantly what you need anyway because you run out of that but for meals I'm all right now till next week so the end of next week so that's good 
So if you like food, my food haul, guys, let me know in the comments down below. Um, let me know if you enjoy them. So I will try and get one on once a week for you. And we can go through prices and where is best. I do love my Aldi. I will never change my Aldi, guys. I love my Aldi. I feel like I'm cheating on my Aldi if I go somewhere else. So I don't do it. I love Aldi so much because you get so more, so much more for your money. That's my view. That's my view. Might not be everyone's, but it is mine. Um, so, yeah. So, if you like this video, give it a big, big thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in our next one. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye-bye now.